up, Jaywalkers? We're back at it with another reaction, and this time we're going to be watching Season 2, Episode 2 of Buffy, and I'm ready for it. The first episode of the season was a really nice one. I enjoyed everything we got from it. Buffy, she was good throughout. She was, of course, going through it. Wasn't really herself dealing with the, the aftermath of taking the master out and all that. She was a bit rude, made a few mistakes, but... Um, yeah, I did love what we got from her. Loved the scene where she was able to smash the Master's bones the way Angel held her after. And uh, the way we were able to, to save our precious Giles and Willow. And uh, Cordelia and Miss Calendar. It was a hell of a moment, but uh, definitely a moment Buffy needed. Um... But yeah, we did enjoy the first episode, and we're ready to see what we get here in episode two. But full reactions will be over on my Patreon page. Link to that will be in the description box of every video over here on YouTube if you want to check them out. Feel free to hit the link and do so. That being said, we're jumping into it. Let's go. Come on, Stefan, rise and shine. Hey. <gasps> Is this a bad time? Are you crazy? You don't just sneak up on people in a graveyard. You make noise when you walk. You stomp or yodel post. I'm gonna yodel every time Maybe I sneak up on anyone. Up play. When you first wake up, <laughs> so uh, you're here alone? Yeah. Not anymore. Why? Xander or someone. Xander. Or someone. No. Nope. Angel. Why? Are you jealous? <laughs> oh, Xander? Please. Is it because I dance with him? Danced with is a pretty loose I'd term. Mated with might be a little close. There's one little dance, which I only did to make you crazy, by the way. But hold my I am fight. You always bring up the vampire. Well, I didn't come here to fight. Scrap. What's my stake? I know I had a stake. Then she stick. What do you mean he's just a kid? Does that mean I'm just a kid too? Look, obviously I made a mistake coming. Turn to walk away from me like that. It takes more than that to get rid of me. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you okay? Yeah, we're just gonna go to bed Fine. for the night. Oh. Feel free to join. Another vampire has risen tonight. I don't think so. Look at those tracks. She was dragged from it. I don't mean to appear indecorous. It's, it's um, a, a, a social engagement, a, a, a date, if you're amenable. You idiot! Boy. Oh, you adorable! Never you might want to leave off the idiot part. Being called an idiot tends to take people out of the dating mood. It actually kind of turns me on. I fear you. You I also might want to avoid. Them. Hey, I got a thing. You maybe have a thing. Maybe we could have a thing. Oh, thank you, sir. And a beautiful I'm thing it would be. Hey, how do you feel about Mexican? About Mexicans? Mexican. Let's not food. say that at all. Let's you not. Pay for food for which you then pay. Just so this chairwoman. What money? Oh, we are shit, talking Miss Calendar is reasonably dalsom, especially for someone in your age bracket. She already knows that you're a school librarian, so you don't have to worry about how to break that embarrassing. Suddenly deciding this is none of your business. You know, because that whole stork thing is a smokescreen. <laughs> so, um, how did things go last night? Found an empty grave. Another vampire? No, no, this one was dug up and the body was taken out. Grave robbing? Well, that's new. Interesting. Hey, gross and disturbing. Yes, 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 of course. A terrible thing. Must, must put a stop to it. <laughs> Why does someone want jealous. to dig up graves? Smile. Hey. Ah, oh, look at those legs. No, thank you. Eric, you can knock Oscar. it off. Hey, it's Chris. Hey. I was just wondering what you were going to do this year. Why? Because every year you win and I play second, so I just thought I'd see what I'm up against. I understand your experiment. It gives you higher marks, so it looks like you understand your experiment. Effects of subviolence. I don't think anyone should have to do anything educational in school if they don't want to. The tomato, fruit or vegetable? <clears throat> I wanted to do something I could finish in a weekend, all right? 
Stop it. What are you Another doing? Another good my private collection. Eric, will you quit it? Coming through. Sorry. Uh, sorry to interrupt, the you, but it's the fat signal. <laughs> okay, sure. See you later. Cordelia is so fine. You know, she'd be just perfect for us. Don't be an idiot. She's alive. My God! This shouldn't take long. I'm probably the only girl in school who has the coroner's office bookmarked as a favorite play. I would have asked Chris to help me, but then that would have brought back too many Don't memories. Don't ask Chris to do it. Damn. I found it. Hello, can we do it with my pain, please? There, there. <laughs> Carl, I feel instantly stay. better. Shit, if I was in, in the, the worst pain ever in Charles. On the way to a game. You can touch me. You know what this means. And Fondry might actually. Here's what I've come up with. Demons who eat the flesh of the dead to absorb their souls. Or it could obviously be a, a voodoo practice. We dig up some graves tonight. Oh boy, a field trip. You gonna call Angel? I don't think so. Yeah, why bother him? Shh. BYO shovel? And I'll pack some food. Who else likes those little powdered donuts? Hey. Cordelia? Darn, I have to eh? practice tonight. Boy, I wish I knew you were gonna be Things digging up dead people. Things are Angel. He was acting all jealous and he wouldn't even admit it. Jealous of what? Xander. Sexy dance with him. Am I ever gonna live that down? Nope. <laughs> Irrational. <laughs> I want a damn donut. What makes you do the wacky? Fast if you fems actually picked up a shovel too. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, but pick one up and smack you upside the head. You interrupt our conversation. Daryl Epps, Chris's older brother. He was a big football star. Running. He was a running. Uh, someone who runs and catches. Was he a studly? He was a big time. Cordy's heart. Must possibly proving its existence. He died. Rock climbing or something, he fell. And that's Poor lousy. Are we hoping to find a body or no body? Call me an optimist, but I'm hoping to find a fortune in gold doubloons. Um, body would mean flesh-eating demon. No body would point towards the army of zombies thing. Take your pick. See you later. Time to run. Paris, if this is some kind of joke. Oh my god. Cordelia, this is the last place I expected you to hang out. Oh god. god, it's you. Why it's were you following? Well, she's a uh, big shock. She's at the graveyard. She said she'd be home. Well, she lied. Isn't she a rascal? Well, we're all in interesting places. Back. Angel. Xander. Angel. I thought you were taking the night off. Donkey. Okay. You told me the truth. <laughs> That's got to be a first. Um, as long as you're here, perhaps you could be of some help. Hmm. 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 Like parts. It was horrible. Angel saved me from an arm. God, there were so many parts. They were everywhere. Why are these terrible things always happening to me? Karma! <coughs> this all didn't add up to three whole girls. I think they kept some parts. Could this get yuckier? They probably kept the other parts to eat. Question answered. Why dispose of the remains? Oh, no. Whoever did it had some business in the neighborhood. Like, say, classes? Oh. Ah. This was my bad. <sighs> student here is going to be that well versed in physiology. I can think of five or six guys in the science club. And me. So, Will, come clean. Promise to never do it again, and we'll call the night. I have to go home now. I have to take a bath and burn my clothes. You have to go? Aw, oh, too bad. Keep in touch. Bye-bye. You take me? Great. I'll try. Hmm. Buffy starts dancing again. Wait, Angel! How about Look that? I... I was pegged him as a one-woman vampire. I'm going out, Mom. Stay your ass inside. Chill. Be back later, okay? Mom? Okay, but that's me when someone talks to me while I'm watching football. I know she's like reminiscing. My fucking son. But that's me during any football game. Chris Epps Locker. Gray's Anatomy, Mortician's Desk Reference, Robichaud's Guide to Muscles and Tendons. I think it's fair to say Chris is involved. I don't know why. Yes, we do. I guess you 
say what can make him about my girl my girl that's my baby she's not your baby she's not gonna be anybody's baby we don't baby finish her soon vocals. i'm working on it Are so my there. friend anybody want to make a girl you mean when there are so many pre-made ones just laying around the things we do for love love has nothing to do with this maybe not but i'll tell you this people don't fall in love with what's right in front of them people want to dream what they can't have. It's not doable. I mean, making someone from scraps, actually making them live. If it is, my science project's definitely coming in second this year. And speaking of love. Oh, yes. Hello. Still no sign of our mad doctors? What? Oh, uh, Cooks is yes. Evil. Very good. Feel a thing, but personalize it. Personalize it? She's a techno pagan, right? Come on, Jazz! Bless your laptop. Have fun. <laughs> That'll get you many days. Best of luck. Come on. Miss Calendar. Oh, no, please. Call me Jenny. Miss Calendar's my father. Jenny, then. You know, Jenny. Miss Calendar's my father. Yeah. Oh, I love her so <laughs> much, dude. <laughs> uh, 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 <coughs> Rupert, look, I've got to get inside. Idiot. Hey, that listen, word. if it's important, why don't you just tell me at the game? You're going to the football game? Yeah, you seem surprised. No, no, uh, uh, downloading incantations and, and, and casting bones. I'm game nerd, you nuts. <laughs> You're going too, right? Oh, of course. Always. Yes, sir. Always do. So we should just go together. How do you feel about Mexico? Good. Okay. And then whatever it is you want to tell me, you can just tell me then. Okay? Uh, well, I think that went better than you could ever hope for, Charles. I still don't get how Chris could do it. It's a die. I want to get ahead. Maybe an electrical current come. Eric didn't come to school today. That's no coincidence. Maybe they finished their project. God. What if it worked? What, what if that poor girl is walking around? Poor girls, technically. What could she be thinking? Shut the book up. Mm. I think we have to worry about that just yet. I spoke to a, a press person this morning. Ah, we can worry about it. Right? The police have put together, I would say they're one step short of completing their masterpiece. One step? <laughs> we will lose the entire body if we don't attach a head soon. We have. Time. We don't. It's just one lousy girl. I won't do it. I, I can't. And I, I can't do that. Please don't make me. But you gave me your word. You promised me, little brother. Oh no! Oh, fuck! I need this, Chris. I need someone. Please don't ask me to do this. Don't. Ask me to take a life. People know. They can't see me. They can't. Because you've always been smart. Oh, God, no one sees you. You were always the brains. No one else. Third and long. Seconds to go. Man, don't get your Where football you shit out of here. Where you, you throw? dead. Number five. Fucker. I was gonna drive. Help me, brother. Number six. Buffy's stopping this shit. <laughs> this one. Oh. A man of taste. Oh, yes, 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 of course it accelerates neural decay in the brain cells. After a couple days, oh, they're course. useless. Go to Chris's and meet up. Uh, I'm supposed to be at the big game. Uh, it's Fine, go ahead. We'll take care of this. Well, yes, but shouldn't I? I I'm... Okay, then why don't uh, we all meet there? Fine, yes. Yes. I mean, he's not a vampire. No. It's just a ghoul. Not to be a memory. Rushed 185 yards that night. Four TDs. He was MVP and he made all city that season. That's a hell of a game. Yeah, that was a great one. Um, but is Chris who? I don't know. I've watched that over and over too. The kickoff. He sheds one, two, three defenders, and he breaks into the open field for a 95-yard touchdown. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Oh, you? What are you doing in here? Is something wrong? When Chris came in and all of a sudden someone jumped me. Song. Oh my god, it's time for the cheerleader pyramid at midfield. I've gotta go. Well, are you sure you're okay to go out there? It yeah, you don't have to go. I'm the apex. Correct. Doing is wrong. 
I have to do this for him. It's unholy. He needs someone. Who, Eric? He, he needs, needs industrial strength him. therapy. Ow. He always looked out for Eric me. and your brother. Alone. Everybody loved him. And now he's all alone. Oh my god. You promised me! It's not too late. He's about to snap ah. your neck. Nothing's changed. Your brother's not the only one who can create life. What do you say? Where else could he be? But he would never go out. He's gonna pick up where you left off. Oh. I don't know what it's called that doesn't form a tree of baseball. At its best, it's unadorned aggression. Such a rugged contest. Rugged American football. It prides itself on its virility. It should feel compelled to strap on 40 pounds of protective gear just in order to play rugby. Is this your normal strategy for a first date? <laughs> Dissing my country's national pastime? You say a date. Yeah. Hey, Giles. She hey, is guys, literally perfect. They are literally Eric's perfect. The nothing there. Yeah, oh, nothing but a bunch of gear equipment. So what's the score? Giles like, I don't know what that score is, but I know I'm winning at life right now. Oh crap. And don't go after Cordelia, damn it. Definitely don't do that. What's going on? Just take off the blindfold. I promise I won't scream. I promise. You want the blindfold on? Yes, I won't scream. I promise. Cordelia? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I knew that was coming. I you thought want. it'd be louder than y'all. Okay, there we go. That's enough. Do it again. I you ain't gonna stop I'm me from screaming. Good to that me. motherfucker's in my face. I'm sorry. I'm glad I have a second chance to tell you that. Daryl? I was thoughtless to appreciate how much it meant that you wanted to be with me. We're ready. Ready? Ready for what? You're gonna feel a little pain. Picked up, you'll have the body of a 17-year-old. In fact, you'll have the body of several. Where did he take her? To the rest of the body, to the lab. Where is that? I promised him- Take us to now! Cordelia! So we can be together. We'll be together anyway. I'll be with you, I promise. Is that right? Mm -hmm. You see anything you like? <laughs> Not a damn thing. And when you're finished. In this room. <laughs> Bucky, Terrible. help me! See, they're crazy. It's okay, Cordelia, I'm gonna get you out of here. No, I'm not done with her yet. <laughs> you're done! Finished. Life! <laughs> All right, all right. Wrap it up. Buffy don't need no help. Okay. We do. Help! 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 She's mine. Help! No. We'll be together always. No. Mine. Time he woke up after. He said I shouldn't have brought him back. I, I was just. Trying to look out for him. Like he would have done for me. Sorry about all this. It's okay. Although a good rule of thumb for a first date is don't do anything so exciting that it'll be hard to top on a second date. The little answer this evening actually qualifies a slow night. Wonder who won the game. Just say 
The second date. You noticed that, huh? I noticed so much. Love. Well, I guess that makes sense. That's right. Let's get dates. Hell, even the school librarian sees more action than me. <laughs> you ever think that the world is a giant game of musical chairs and the music stopped and we're the only ones who don't? I just wanted to thank you for saving my life. What you did in there was really brave, brave. and wrote anything I could ever do to. Do you mind? We're talking here. Wondering why we never get dates. Yeah, so why do you think that is? <laughs> That's God, hilarious. They were so you took it a little over the edge. Love makes you do the wacky. What? Crazy stuff. Oh. Crazy like a 241-year-old being jealous of a high school junior? <laughs> about it. Maybe it bothers me a little. I don't love Xander. Yeah, but he's in your life. He gets to be there when I can. Jokes and complaints. He gets to see you in the sunlight. I don't look that good in direct light. Good morning, son. I should probably go. I could walk you home. Four touchdowns, never forget. Here we have it guys, season two, episode two of Buffy. And it was a very enjoyable episode. I liked it. I liked the ending. I love Buffy and Angel and love what we got from them all throughout in this one. But this ending was really good. Angel confessing, saying, you know what? Maybe I am jealous. What about it? I only get to be here at night. Xander. He gets to be there and have all these moments with you throughout that day, and it's bullshit. But we did really enjoy the ending. Buffy walking him home, holding hands together. Ah, it was precious. Enjoyed the opening scene with them. We enjoyed it all. And we really, I love them, but we love Giles and Miss Calendar even more. Miss Calendar, she is once again just literally perfection, and her and Giles are a match made in heaven. God. Uh, but it was a very strong episode for them. They had the date going to the football game. They're gonna have many more, um, and yeah, we love it all. But it was it was it was a strong episode for them. It was a strong episode for Buffy and. Angel, and uh, we enjoyed all the the bullshit we were dealing with in this one as well, with Chris and Eric and them bringing his brother back in a freaking ungodly, unholy way, and then trying to build him a girl as well. It was all it was all terrible. Um, but yeah, the brother he looked awful. Uh, the mother she was gone, just watching old highlights. It was a tragic situation, but yeah, Buffy had a hell of a, a fight with them. We loved the way Xander saved Cordelia. MVP, MVP, this time it's not going to be the person with four touchdowns. Oh no. MVP for this one, we're just going to give to Giles and Miss Callender. I, I just love them so much, dude. and. It, Loved what we got from here. Loved how Giles was acting when he was thinking of how he'd ask her out. We love literally everything about Miss Calendar. Love the date. And we're going to love the dates that are to come. But they were definitely standouts in this one. And they're going to be my MVPs for sure. But another solid episode of Season 2 for Buffy. I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this one. Thank you all for watching.